What's up, PA Box Breakers? It's Rob here again, doing another retail review. You know we're starting to see a little retail back in stores. Nothing really high end, nothing too crazy, but we keep seeing the same product, and we're wondering, should I spend the money on that? So today we're gonna do the Wild Card Matte Black. Um, I know the white have been in the stores. I ran into a box of the black. It's the college, so they're in college uniforms, just like the regular wild card was. Uh, 40 cards per box. And there's an extra chase pack in here. So not sure what's in the chase pack. Um, eight parallels. Find two exclusive box. I mean, two blaster box exclusives. Not sure what the exclusives are. Here's the list of rookies. I mean, they do give you a lot of rookies. I haven't seen other people break it. Um, hopefully we got a red chase pack in here so we can see what we got going on. Uh, oh, duel, oh, the dueling, what's that? Dueling guns and bronze weekend warrior. So I guess that's the exclusives that we're looking for. Um, I know I did the regular black, the hobby is what these look like. Um, I think they come six cards, three autos three one numbered and three i mean two uh base so here's a black patrick certain and then i did the blue i think it came in black blue white and red for the hobby so there's a Devonte smith so that's what the regulars look like not sure i guess we'll compare the black to this black <clears throat> so let's open it up and see what we can Find out. Box uh, retail was 22 22 and some change. Obviously, I'm in PA, so taxes. It's about 24 something, almost $25. I think all retail, no matter what it is now, is high. Um, yeah, but I mean, if you want retail, and I lucked up and went in. Oh, so here's what the packs look like in the box. I don't see any exclusive in here. All right. So we got our four packs. It says 10 cards a pack. So let's see. Let's see what these cards are looking like here. All right. Okay. Cards are pretty sleek. I actually have a little... A little, a little sleeker than the hobby, if you ask me. I'm uh, we got our on Saint Brown. Here's the back. No stats. It's height and weight. I mean, pretty bland. I mean, but it is a nice looking card. So let's see what we got here. Cade Johnson. Jamie Newman. Newsome. And I don't know why they came out with another product with the college uniforms. And we're almost a quarter into the season. It's so Michael Parsons. He's playing well. Not a cowboy guy, though, as you can see by the background. It's a nice card. Uh, Tylen Wallace. I noticed there's no RC or anything on here. So I'm, I'm, I'm guessing it's all rookies. Javante Williams, and we got, it looks like a purple here. Jalen Phillips, so this is a parallel. Again, nothing on the back, nothing too crazy. I mean, it's pretty standard, it looks like. Just college uni with a pick, black back background. I mean, I do like the, the gold borders and the words. I mean, I wish they would have at least put rookie or something on here. Something. Um, here's an Ian Book. It's Trey Lance. I actually had an auto of him in the matte black. It's a Pitts. So you're getting, looks like J.C. Horn. We're getting a lot of the, the big rookies. She Smith. Here's something back here. Quitty Pay. I don't know if that's... What was the uh, parallel? Dueling Guns or Bronze Warriors? I don't think that's one of them. So maybe this is sort of an insert. 
the green flames coming off of them. Um, oh, there we go. Vontae Smith. I guess that's a pink. I didn't see anything as far as like a list of anything else you could hit. That, that all rookie. Oh, it's an all rookie card edition. So there you go. Doesn't tell you anything except the two blaster exclusives. I guess that's a picture of the dual dueling guns right there. These are subsets, we give warriors. I don't see anything with the flame on it, so I don't know. It's not an overwhelming product. I mean, you are getting the rookies. Um, Caleb, so Joe Tryon, uh, Rondell Moore, Chuba Hubbard. I mean, you get Penny. Oh, here we go. I think we got one of the things here. What is this? The, the uh, Weekend Warrior? I think this is the Weekend. Yeah, there it is up on the top. Can you see it? The W. Sorry. But right there, it says WW. It's a Weekend Warrior. So we got one of the exclusives of a Justin Fields. And I'll take that. Oh, that one actually has this, some stats on it. It's college stats. So, okay. And then we got, I guess this pink, pink. It's, I think we got one of those in each pack. Let me sleeve that Justin Fields up just because it's one of the exclusives. Don't know. Put that in there. I mean, what do you think so far? I mean, I mean, they're nice looking cards, but I mean, $25 at retail, well, in PA at least, with sales tax, if you live somewhere where the tax is higher, I mean, the box is a little more expensive, obviously. Um, I don't know. I mean, I like the look of the card. I think Panini's just putting out stuff in between for retail. I mean, the Optic Basketball Pretty much came and went pretty fast. Sort of died down really quick. Hunter Long. Najee Harris. There you go. There's our Pittsburgh guy for Steve. PA Box Breakers. Landon. There goes a Zach Wilson. Okay, so we got, what, three of the quarterbacks. Oh, there you go. It's a Trevor. Base. Another Najee. Is that the same Najee? So one pack, same exact card. No numbers, no anything. Hmm. Okay. Um, it's another Quitty Pay. It's another ETN. Oh, here we go. We got the Trevor Lawrence Weekend Warrior. I guess that's the picture they had on the box. Right there. So we hit two Weekend Warriors. It's like a bronzes color, looks like. And again, these are the only ones that I've seen the stats on the back. <coughs> Excuse me, so I'm gonna sleeve that up. What do you guys think? I mean, for between 24 and $25. I mean, I know we've seen them on the shelves. I'm not sure if you picked one up yourself or not. If you got the white pack, the matte white or the matte black, I think they should have just kept this as a hobby box with the guaranteed autos and when they first came out um i don't know what's up with the the blaster retails with no guaranteed anything like there's nothing guaranteed in here but it tells you you will find on average i'm assuming find two blaster box exclusives i don't know if we're i guess the only thing is the chase pack that's different that's what the chase pack looks like and then here you can get red, randomly inserted into the blaster box. These chase packs are one ton to the production of regular matte black cards, but it doesn't tell you what you get in them. So tell me what you think. <clears throat> I mean, we've seen the cards. I mean, we got, it's all rookies. College uniforms. If you're a fan of college uniforms, then 
It's another Trevor. If you're a fan of the college uniforms, then maybe this is a, a good product for you. I don't know if it's $25 worth of good product for you. This must be a parallel. Um, yeah, no numbered. I guess we'll call those inserts, these here or this. Um, $25 to me. Was that a late? Yeah, the Trey Lance. So, I mean, I hit almost all the, the good quarterbacks. His book. What you guys think? $25 a sleek looking car, but I don't know for $25 getting rookie uniforms at this point is is anything special unless, you know, that's what you're looking for for your own collection. So, um, yeah, I probably would pass on this myself. Um, I wish we would have hit that extra pack, the pink pack or red pack, whatever it was, the wild card pack, chase pack, so we could have seen what that looks like. Um, but let us know in the comments what you're thinking. Um, I, I say thumbs down just for me personally. I'm not a huge fan of the college uniforms. Um, at the beginning I am when they first come out because they're fresh and it's like, Hey, this is their first, you know, card ever when they come out with their college uniforms. So I do like those, but once you get further into the season, these guys already played seven, eight games. I'd like to see the pro unis. That's just me personally. Um, so thumbs up or thumbs down. Um, I'm going to keep trying to bring you some retail that, that we're starting to see on the shelves, see if it's worth it or not. I think next I'm going to do a Chronicles basketball, the college uniforms. I know those are being left on the shelves, so I grabbed a couple box of those to see why are they being left. So um, anyway, let us know in the comments what you think. As always, PA Box Breakers out. Buy it, break it, rip it. See you later.